Hello, today I am going to show you how to create canvas textures in Photoshop and how to apply it to an artwork. My name is Ivan Gromov and I've been working with Photoshop in a professional capacity for 9 years and I'm also a creative stock author for Envato Market. Before we start, I would like to recommend you Envato Elements. Here you can find a great collection of textures, backgrounds and other Photoshop tools for your next design project. Let's start by creating a new document with 300 by 200 pixel size. After that, go to Layer, New Fill Layer, Salad Color and set the color to F7, F7, E4. Let's add some noise to this layer. Go to Filter, Noise, Add Noise and set the amount to 15 distribution to Gaussian and check the monochromatic box. Now go to Filter Gallery and select the cross hatch effect with the following settings. Length 17, Sharpness 4, Strength 1. After that we need to apply water paper effect from the Filter Gallery and use the following settings. Length 15, Brightness 60, Contrast 62. Double click on the icon near the smart filter and set the mode to darken. Now let's add texturizer filter to the layer. And set the texture to canvas, scaling to 50 and relief to 2. Go to filter gallery one more time and select node paper with the following settings. Balance 21, graininess 10, relief 11. Change the blend mode of this smart filter to darken. Let's apply the last filter, Crackelure. Set the spacing to 20, depth to 4 and brightness to 9. and then change the blend mode of the smart filter to multiply and the opacity to 35%. Here is our canvas texture, as you can see it looks pretty boring, but we will fix it in the next step. Create a new layer and then go to filter, render, clouds and finally change the blending mode of this layer to soft light and the opacity to 55%. This is how our texture should look like now. Now let's add our texture as a background. I have created this beautiful artwork with watercolor Photoshop action by Unique Design. I highly recommend you to check this effect as it will help you to create amazing paintings from your photos in a few simple clicks. So let's right click on any layer and select flatten image. After that, all you need to do is drag and drop the texture above the background layer. And here's our artwork with the texture applied as a background. Let's try to use our canvas texture as an overlay. Drag and drop your canvas texture above all the layers. And after that, just change the blend mode of the texture to multiply. If you don't like how your overlay looks, you can try other blend modes or change brightness and contrast of the layer. Let's select our canvas texture and go to Image, Adjustments, Brightness Contrast and set the brightness to 35 and contrast to 45. Today you have learned how to create canvas texture in Photoshop from scratch and how to use it as an overlay and background. Thank you for watching and don't forget to check our channel for more tutorials.